If you are grateful to be alive today, can I hear you shout hallelujah with a heart of thanksgiving and gratitude to God. Despite all that has befallen the world, you are alive, you are healthy, your family is alive and together, and you are alive, hale and healthy. I want you to shout hallelujah, hallelujah. You are welcome to the 10th day of our 21 days fasting and prayers of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. And today the focus of our prayer is thanksgiving for the successes recorded in our past Let's Go Afishing. You are welcome to this platform. My name is Olumide Odessonya. If this is your first time here, kindly like this video, share with your friends and subscribe to this channel to be a part of this community. We meet here every single day of the fasting and prayers to pray the prayer points and guide that have been outlined for us. So today our prayer focus is on thanksgiving for the past successes of the Let's Go Afishing, of course, in the redeemed Christian Church of God. And our text is taken from the book of Mark chapter 16, Mark chapter 16, verse 15 to 18. The word of the Lord says, and he said unto them, Go ye into the world and preach the gospel to every creature. He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved, but he that believeth not shall be damned. And these signs shall follow them that believe. Hallelujah. In my name shall they cast out devils. He says, And they shall speak with new tongues. They shall take up serpents. And if they drink any deadly thing, it shall not hurt them. They shall lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. For all these that God has done in the redeemed Christian church of God, in obedience to this injunction, to this great commission, God has moved the redeemed Christian church of God from just Nigeria here to several nations of the world. I want to thank him that he has stayed true to his word. He has been faithful to this promise of going with us and for making signs and wonders to happen in his church. Glory and honor we ascribe to his name. And we're going to read the introduction before we start our prayers. Our Lord Jesus left a clear instruction that we should go to the whole world to win souls and baptize them. This program of winning souls or crusade is called Let's Go A Fishing in the Redeemed Christian Church of God. And we need to thank God for the successes recorded so far. Can I hear somebody say, thank you, Jesus. The Redeemed Christian Church of God, as we know her to be today, was handed over to our Father and the Lord, Pastor Iyadeboye, Adeboye, with just about 39 parishes. But to the glory of God today, in Nigeria alone, we have over 40,000 parishes. And of course, in other nations and other continents of the world, we have several other parishes. Indeed, God had increased his church mightily. God had multiplied his church, enlarged his church through the ministry of the Let's Go Afishing. So we're going to thank God for the successes recorded in the past and for using his children all over the world to achieve this great vision of the kingdom of God. Our first prayer point is to bless the name of the Lord, that everything within us should bless the name of the Lord. We bless you, Lord. We bless you, Lord. We bless you, Lord. Yes, we bless you, Lord, because you are God. Say, I bless your name, Lord. I bless your name. My soul blesses your name. Yes, I bless your name, because you are God. Lord, everything within us praise you today. We look back and we think deeply to say thank you for the increase that we have recorded in the redeemed Christian Church of God through the Let's Go Fishing taking place during the Easter period and during the Christmas period and for several other programs, outreaches, crusades. Our souls bless you today. In Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. Our God, we praise you because of your mighty works in the name of Jesus. Oh, you are worthy, Jesus, you are worthy. You are worthy to be glorified. 
You are worthy, we praise you. You are worthy, Jehovah. You are worthy to be glorified. Lord, for your great works in our midst, we say thank you. Thank you for the demonstration of your power, of your presence in the redeemed Christian Church of God through the Let's Go Efficient program. Thank you for all the lives that you have transformed, that you have delivered out of darkness and you have brought into the kingdom of your dear son, into the kingdom of light. Lord, we say thank you for your great works. This can only be your doing, Lord, and it is marvelous in our sight. Be glorified in Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. You say, our God, we praise your name. You are gracious in the name of Jesus. Lord, we praise you because you are gracious. The Bible tells us that the grace of God that brings salvation has appeared unto all men. Thank you, Lord, for that grace that has appeared to us, our loved ones, our friends, our neighbors, that had brought us into the fold of believers and saints. Lord, we say thank you for your grace that has reached out unto us, that has delivered us from the yoke of sin, delivered us from the bondage of hell. Lord, we say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, we appreciate you, Lord. Thank you for your grace, for your abundant grace, for your manifold grace that has delivered us from the hands of the enemy. In Jesus' name, we give thanks. Amen. You say, our Father in heaven, we praise you because you are a righteous God in the name of Jesus. Thank you because you are a righteous God. Thank you because you are a righteous God. And it is in your righteousness that we say, you are promised you will never fail. Yes, Lord, we will follow you. We will follow you in your righteousness. Lord, you are promised you will never fail your faithfulness is forevermore your faithfulness is forevermore our righteous god who does not want anyone to perish but that all should come to the knowledge of god should come to repentance and to salvation Thank you for your righteousness that is expressive, that is real in the redeemed Christian church of God. Through the Let's Go Our Fishing, anytime we go out, you go with us and you come home, you return with us with a harvest of souls. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. You say, Lord, we praise you for you are a compassionate God in the name of Jesus. Lord, we praise you for your compassionate God. Thank you for your compassion that has delivered us from the eternal damnation that we were brought into by the sin of Adam and Eve. Thank you, Jehovah God, for your eternal law, for your compassion, for your compassion, for your faithfulness. Lord, we thank you. We thank you. He loves us. We cannot say why. Jesus loves us. We cannot explain why. On Calvary's tree, he suffered for us, oh, he loves us, we cannot say why, say, he loves me, I cannot say why, he loves me, I cannot say why, on Calvary tree, Jesus suffered and died for me, he loves me, I cannot say why. That is your story, that is my story, that is your testimony, that is my testimony, that we are recipients of the compassion and the love of God. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. Say, Father, we thank you for the privilege to win souls into your kingdom in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for the privilege. It's a privilege not because we are experts, not because we can pray, not because we can fast, not because we even know scriptures to use, not because we are bold and confident. No, Lord, it's a privilege to partner with you, the spirit being, the spiritual God, the God of all flesh. It's a privilege to partner with you, to reach out to souls and for the souls to be one to you. Lord, we come to say thank you for this privilege. Not many Many people have this privilege. Not many people are opportuned. Many are still in the world, under the yoke of the devil, under captivity. But Lord, we have been called out to partner with you. We say thank you for the privilege. 
for through this privilege you have increased your church even through the let's go our fishing thank you heavenly father we are grateful for it be glorified in jesus name we give thanks amen you will say father we thank you for your spirit that enabled us to win souls in the past crusades in the name of jesus lord we thank you for your spirit for it is not by power not by might but by my spirit seeth the lord according to your word in zechariah 4 6 lord we come to say thank you for the manifestation and the demonstration of your spirit in our midst that whenever people hear your word their hearts are open to receive your word lord we say thank you for the manifestation of your spirit it is the spirit that gives life the flesh profits nothing the letter kills but the spirit gives life we thank you for the life of god in the word of god that has brought many to the knowledge of salvation lord we say thank you for your spirit holy spirit divine we worship you holy spirit divine we thank you for your work in your church for your manifestation in your church oh for moving across the length and breadth of our nations and the nations of the world to turn many to righteousness to turn many to salvation even through the let's go affishing lord we say thank you somebody say thank you holy spirit again say thank you holy spirit in jesus name we give thanks amen you will say father we thank you because the gate of hell has never prevented us from winning souls in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, because the gate of hell has never prevented us from winning souls into your kingdom. Lord, we are grateful because of the power we have to conquer the gates of hell. For if God be for us, no one can be against us. Not the devil, not demons, not principalities, not powers. Lord, we thank you because we have not allowed the gate of hell to resist the expansion of your kingdom through the redeemed Christian church of God, through the Let's Go Fishing programs and the crusade. Lord, we say thank you. Lord, we say thank you. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, we thank you for those strategies we have adopted and they are working for us in the name of Jesus. Thank you for the strategies that have been adopted that are working for us. Strategies of the corporate social responsibility or Christian social responsibility. Strategies of empowerment strategies of development, communal development, societal development. Lord, we thank you for these divine strategies that had empowered your church to grow, to increase, to draw many, both unbelievers, the, the sinners, the Muslims, whatever religion, whatever culture. Thank you for the various strategies that your church had deployed to reach out to many souls. The strategy of planting a church in five minutes walking distance in developing nations and five minutes driving distance in developed nations. The strategy of having every member, every member of redeemed Christian Church of God in families of the world. Lord, we thank you for these strategies that are working. For these strategies that you have empowered and that are working for the expansion of your church. Lord, we bless your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, I thank you for establishing the souls that are won in the past crusade. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for the establishments of souls that have been won in the past crusade. Thank you for men and women, old and young, black and white, in Africa, outside Africa, that have been won to you and that you have established their feet in the redeemed Christian church of God. Amongst them, you have raised workers. Amongst them, you have raised evangelists. You have raised pastors. You have raised prophets. Amongst them, you have raised mighty instruments in your hands that have been used in this great mission all over the world. Thank you, Lord God Almighty, for the life of my brother and my sister praying these prayers right now. Thank you, Lord, for our lives. Thank you, Lord, for establishing our feet in the redeemed Christian church of God and for making us relevant ambassadors in your house, for using us in our various spheres of influence to portray, to speak the word of God and to turn many to righteousness. Lord, we say thank you for the establishment of our souls in this mission. Oh, in Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, 
We thank you for open heavens at the locations of the past Let's Go Our Fishing programs. Oh Lord, we thank you. We thank you for open heavens. Lord, if you decide not to open the heavens, we will struggle. We will labor with nothing to show for it. But Lord, we are grateful and we come to say thank you for heavens that have been opened over our past crusades. Over our past, let's go our fishing. Some other ministry may not know how it is done. They may be asking, what are we doing? What are you, what buttons are you pressing? What strategies are you deploying? Beyond all those questions is the fact that heaven is opened over us. Heaven is opened over the redeemed Christian church of God. Heaven is opened over the Let's Go Fishing program. Heaven is opened over our crusade and outreaches. Why? Because it is the heartbeat of God, the great commission. Lord, we thank you in your mercy. You have decided to open the heavens over the redeemed Christian church of God and over all our crusades. Be glorified, be exalted. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Blessed be your name, Jehovah. In Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. Oh, thank you, Jesus. And brethren, as we pray this prayer, just to make it more interactive for others that will join us, you can type Amen in the comment section below so that people can know that we pray this prayer together and we believe God heard us together. Thank you, Father. You are going to say, Father, we thank you for signs and wonders at all past crusades in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you for miracles, signs and wonders. Thank you for the great mighty miracles that you have wrought in our past Let's Go Fishing programs and crusade. Thank you for the blind seeing, for the dumb speaking, for the deaf hearing, for the lame walking, for the barren becoming fruitful, for the insane becoming sane, for the mad becoming healed, for the depressed receiving hope. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for how you have visited your people through this program with diverse signs and wonders, for wiping tears away from the eyes of the barren, for giving them their children, for those who had been written off, for bringing them out of the ashes of their past into the new realms of glory of their future. Lord, we say thank you for the great and mighty things you are doing in the redeemed Christian Church of God through the Let's Go Fishing programs and all our crusades. In Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, thank you for diverse healings in the past crusade in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, we thank you. We thank you for diverse healings that are taking place in our past programs, past Let's Go Our Fishing programs. Lord, we say thank you for the healing. You send forth your word. Psalm chapter 107 verse 20. Thank you for sending forth your word in all our crusades to heal, to deliver, to set free. Lord, we say thank you for the healing power of God present and available to heal during our past Let's Go Our Fishing. Healing wounds, healing hearts, healing sicknesses, healing infirmities, healing diseases. Diseases. Lord, we cannot count them all. We say thank you. In Jesus' name we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, we thank you for all the departments that worked tirelessly for the successes of those crusades. Thank you for all the departments that have been working tirelessly in all our crusades, in all our Let's Go Our Fishing. Let's give thanks to God. At least for as many of us that have been partaking in this Let's Go Our Fishing, we can mention several units and departments that have been partaking in the successes of this program. From the committee, the organizing committee, to the quarry stars, to the ushers, to the security officials, to the protocols, to the ministers, everyone, even the children department teachers, everyone had been working collectively in harmony to make sure our Let's Go Our Fishing succeed. Oh, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you for kingdom builders, men and women, you have raised to support this vision with their resources, with their connection. Lord, we say thank you for men and women all over the world that you have used for the expansion of your church and the redeemed Christian church of God through our crusades and through our Let's Go Our Fishing programs. Blessed be your holy name. God of heaven, we thank you. In Jesus' name, we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, we thank you for the zeal of our workforce in winning souls at this crusade in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you for the zeal of our workforce in winning souls, in going out. Some will take time out from their businesses. Some will take their leave during the Let's Go Fishing period. Some will cancel family meetings, cancel programs just to be a part of the Let's Go Fishing. Lord, we thank you for the passion, for the zeal, for the commitment, for the doggedness. Lord, we say thank you for everyone that are 
are involved in the Let's Go Fishing programs and that you have been using for the workforce. Thank you for the tenacity, for the zeal, for the confidence in you. Lord, we appreciate you. In Jesus' mighty name, we give thanks. Amen. You will say, Father, we thank you, Lord, for convincing the sinners yourself. Lord, we thank you. Hey, Paul may plant, Apollo may water, but only God gives the increase. Lord, we say thank you for convincing the sinners yourself as they hear your word, they could not resist your word. Thank you, Lord, for reaching out to them by the power in your word, beyond the letter, by reaching out to their souls to surrender their lives to you. Jehovah God, we say thank you. Lord, we say thank you for your spirit that is at work, saving souls, redeeming lives to Jesus. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, we give thanks. Amen. We say, Father, we thank you for the signs and wonders that will follow our youth as... We are going to... Let us say, Father, we thank you because none of these new converts that have been saved in the past, that have been saved now or will be saved in the future, will ever go back into sin in the name of Jesus. Lord, none of the new converts will go back into the world. They will be planted in you. They will be established in you. They will keep growing deep in you and growing up in you. In the name of Jesus, Lord, none of the converts will go back into the world. The strength to remain connected with you, not to be discouraged, Lord, Lord, not to look back. Give unto them. All the new converts will be established. And Lord, your church will continue to increase and will continue to grow. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We say, Daddy, we are thanking you because more souls shall be won in subsequent. Let's go out fishing. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for more souls. Thank you, Lord, for more souls. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, we are together again. Just thanking the Lord. We are together again in one accord. Something good is already happening. Something better is in store. We are together again. We are together again. We are together again. And praising the Lord. We are praising the Lord. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for the souls that will be won. That you will use us to win into your kingdom. In Jesus' mighty name, we give thanks. Amen. As you have prayed these prayers, your faith will increase in God and you will not look back into the world. God has used you and he has raised you to be a shining light to others. Your light will not grow dim and the almighty God will continue to use your life to turn many to righteousness as a living testimony in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for joining us to pray these prayers today. By the grace of God, if Jesus starish, tomorrow again we'll be here to pray together. Remember, like this video, share with friends and families, and also subscribe to this channel if you are yet to do so. See you tomorrow. By the grace of God, remain blessed in Jesus' name. Amen.